are feeding their pets, believing that it is with a good intention that a nice chubby animal is healthier. <laughs> and that's, as we know, is not always the case. In researching diabetes for our Heart of the Valley series, we've learned diabetes can also be a problem for pets. Valley veterinarian John Montalbano says older pets are more likely to develop diabetes. He says it's more common with animals that are overeating and inactive. Spayed or neutered animals are more likely to be overweight, which goes hand in hand with diabetes. As for dinner table scraps? Be as, as sparse on the people food as you should be. As you would imagine, if uh, the owner feels as though they love their dog, cat enough to feed it table food. It is not necessarily for their benefit. Pet foods are balanced for the nutrients that a dog would need in, depending on the, even its activity level. Diabetes can cause blindness in cats and dogs just as it does in people. Warning signs are similar too. Dr. Montalbano says you should look out for more frequent urination.